Well, why exactly is there a barrel full of skulls? I mean, it's in the tavern. This, you know the stickers you get at the front of restaurants? This is going to bring the hygiene rating down to a two, for sure. For sure. I mean, who puts a barrel of skulls next to the door of a tavern? It's like the barmaid was like, hey, Duke, Duke, Duke. Did you get the barrel of skulls, Duke? Did you get the barrel of skulls? Good. We've got the barrel of skulls. <laughs> Congratulate. Is this like patrons forget to like pay their bills, so they just put their skulls in? Who puts skulls in a barrel? Hey, peeps. Falco here. So, I just wanted to touch on something that I feel very strongly about, and being somewhat a voice for Sea of Thieves, I think I should definitely cover. Toxic behaviour in video games seems to be an okay thing to do these days. Countless times I see people say, Everyone else does it, so why can't I? That does not make it okay. Now don't get me wrong, we all like to throw jabs at one another, especially in a PvP game, but there is a way it can be done where both parties involved come out of it with a smile on their face. Killing someone and screaming, ha ha ha, get f***ed, for example, not only creates and breeds toxicity, it also proves to everyone involved and everyone watching how narrow-minded and immature you are. Do not promote this kind of behaviour. You can still fill your pockets with smugness after a successful kill by simply saying, nice try man, or better luck next time. The developers outlined this problem in a recent development blog and talked about the pirate code. Now, try to understand that the pirate code is not something you should live by. It's more of a suggestion of acts that you should look over before acting on your desires. Everyone who watches my live streams know that I treat other players with respect, even if they are hostile toward me. Now that doesn't mean that I deploy hugs and pop chocolate flavoured rainbow farts, I do engage in PvP and I do steal loot and sink other players. But I make sure I do it in a way where both parties involved have a lot of fun. Online gaming should be about fun and being respectful to someone else's fun. It's not all about you and your gaming session, and it really angers me that people who are deemed successful entertainers in gaming media think that promoting this kind of behaviour is fine. We are all human beings, we all come from different backgrounds, we all have different age ranges, and we play on different platforms. We have all had a hard day and come online to relax and have a laugh with other like-minded people. Be respectful, and if you come across someone else being toxic toward you, do you want to know the worst thing you can do in retaliation? Be respectful to them. Show them the right way to act. If someone spawn kills you and screams, LOL, learn to play scrub, get better, reply with, you have a great day now. And if they continue to pursue you and hassle you, drop the server, move to another, there is no point in retaliating as that is exactly what they want you to do. Respect will always earn you respect. Be a pirate gentleman, not a toxic idiot. Thanks for watching all, if you liked the video please go ahead and click that like button and if you really liked the video please go ahead and click that subscribe button and hell click the bell so you're always informed of Sea of Thieves news updates and the general random guff that I might upload. Until next time everybody, happy sailing, bye bye.